We've got a new patch coming out shortly, 108N, and that has a bunch of fixes and a couple new things. One is uh, you can now have much longer wolf biographies. So if you've had to restrict yourself to a short biography, you can now have about 300 words more or less. So you can really get in depth in talking about your wolf. And not only can you do that here in the wolf customization, but once you're in the game and you open up pack info and go to your bio, you can edit your bio there too. And it'll just save instantly and automatically. So we know that's something players have been wanting for a long time. And uh, now with this new bio sub panel, we have room for it. The other thing is something that's been in the works for quite a while, actually. We actually first started working on these animations uh, a year and a half ago, I guess. And a couple times over the past year, sketched out how to implement them, but other things always came up. And so we finally done it now. And that is uh, now when you're chasing elk, they might stumble and fall and give you an opportunity to get in there and uh, get some bites in. Real wolves out in the wild often do rely on just getting lucky with uh, the moment of bad luck for their prey. And first of all, that gives you a moment to get in there if you're quick and bite it and do some damage. And the fall itself can do some damage. Sometimes it's just a little damage, sometimes it's quite a bit of damage. Now here for this video, I've increased the odds of them happening quite a bit, so I don't have to wait so long to get one, but it's much less common in the game. So you'll have to keep your eyes out to take advantage of this opportunity. So these two things and a lot more is now in the 108N public beta, which is available on Steam now for Mac and Windows. And uh, hopefully it won't be too long before we make the final tweaks and fixes and get it out into general release for everybody. Last week we went camping in southern Minnesota, and one day after a big rainstorm, Susan went out to see if uh, she could spot the beavers that we'd been watching earlier that day, and instead came across this. She watched it for a minute and it turned and looked at her like, are you my mother? And quickly realized, no you're not, and just dropped. And so we actually got a pretty good look at it. 